Okay, let's see what restoring in a roster entry. I don't think it's possible actually at the moment. Some people like dollar dollar dollar. Well, money makes poor. Everyone knows. Discord again. Oh, thanks for joining Discord, uh, Esserinians. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna give the skull plug in a try. For intelligence, yeah, that's pretty good, right? I didn't know. Uh, you actually found that definition inside. I saw a presentation about it, uh, but uh, I feel I feel I can't embed an Emacs yet. Right away, I would throw away my, my entire build up with the window manager I have. And if I would use IntelliJ, you can't even see my background anymore. Because it would be full screen, right? Yeah, too many problems. Too many problems. But you wouldn't even be able to see Hasoka. <laughs> IntelliJ supports transparent background. No, you don't understand. Every window supports transparent backgrounds. Everything. I didn't do it per window. I did. I did it with a compositor or something. I don't know. Like some program, and I enabled some flags, and everything worked. Okay. Oh yeah, sure. Yeah, I did. Proof you. I'll prove you with code. Yes, Compton. It's really easy. You just do this services, Compton, blah, and then suddenly you have that. Trivial. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what is up to date? Play safe. Is it some safe? Come back and replace it. Then ST. Is, what? How did you copy it? In the background. Not do the rest of you or something. Let's, um. I want to show why we can't finish this right now. I want to briefly. Briefly touch upon the issue we're facing. We actually need to do a migration, I think. Uh, but I want to see it for myself first. Maybe I fix it as well. I don't think so, but maybe. Um, where am I going? Oh, this is the wrong project. That's a problem. <laughs> right. Let's uh, fork this then. So, roster entry. No, 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 we need to go to database. We actually have some dev backend work to do, I think. We need to make the sense migration. So, this thing doesn't know about places yet. It only knows about, um, well, you get an idea, you get a reason, you get a type, which is uh, work, whatever, pre-request, um, you get a job, maybe job, which is like, uh, you can override your default job with that, start time, end time, work time, which is to, to tra time tracking basically, uh, timer status, day, and then like links to, so this is like foreign keys, uh, in Beam at least, 
I never showed Beam, I think. Uh, this is how you do Beam. It's It has many magics. Uh, one of the things you can do is doing arrow fields per row. So you can put here like a maybe in here. Or either. Either error. And then like you can get the error messages per field or whatever. It's like really flexible way of doing it. Unfortunately we can't send this over the server because it also has the ID field. Why is update in place safe? It's safe because all the combinators then use the state only single thread manner. That is they each use incoming state exactly once. Okay, it's you use record? I hear they are shit. This is record yeah. This is record syntax. Um Uh, what what's kind of interesting about this is that you use that F thing. Uh, that's like not standard. And this C thing is also something. I don't. It's like a beam thing. Don't worry about it. Um. So yeah, we we are, we are lacking one foreign key, basically to place. Uh, this is gonna make things complicated though, because I don't want to force places upon everyone. I think. The guy's playing Aquarik again. Or um, Aquarik is playing World of Warcraft again. Great. Why doesn't he program anymore? What? Uh. Uh, there are language programs. Uh. Yeah, Haskell code records are just tuples with accessor functions and nominal abstraction. I'd like them to be more powerful too. Well, there's like a kind of beauty to the simplicity Haskell provides, I would say. Like you have this very simple building block and on top of that you build all these syntactic abstractions. But what I really want is um, like Elm has, the fact that you can extend them and uh, remove some of them. Because if I can drop this ID field for example, I could just basically send this, this entire thing over the network. But I can't, so yeah, I can't use this data type, I need to make another one. Well, yeah, this ID field and these uh, credentials or whatever. They could just work in IntelliJ Park. Someone is falling in love. <laughs> sure they do. You have split windows. Now there are problems. Well, it's written in Java for one. Patience is as smart as Emacs. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure if I like the indentation in Emacs. Twitch their own. Why? Why is this there and the other one there? What the fuck? Why? How is this smart? It doesn't make sense. Anyway, yeah, well, we can we can add the key. I want to make it nullable though. I want to make it optional. Mm. I want to make it optional because I have a bunch of old data <laughs> that I need to keep support. Uh, what if you don't have any place? And you don't show up in the other table. Okay, fuck, this is gonna be a problem. Like, I feel like as soon as you insert the first place, then everything gets automatically attached to that or something. That's maybe what I should do. Okay, this is actually a very big change because I need to do migration.
Noble for these. Alright, okay, we can just do that. Cool. We'll do that. I think uh, Sour doesn't want Santa to set up any emacs or whatever. Oh, what am I doing? Not nullable. Place. We'll make it nullable and we'll figure out some rules or whatever. Uh, place T. Yeah, this is it. There's no reference to TT as far as code plugin, so I don't think it is. What? Okay, let's disable the row table thing because we need to do back and shit first. To do, figure out who is in which what place. So I think we also need to do like a default thing then, uh, in that. How are you happy with Cabal? I don't think anyone's happy with Cabal. No, who's happy with Cabal? Cabal, a secret political clique or faction. Ah, that sounds about right. What's not to like? It it, 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 like, <laughs> yeah, it feels like that. <sighs> it's, it's aptly named. Well, we're good at naming things in Haskell. Functor, Monad, whatever. Applicative. Don't all these names make sense to you? Then the table. Shut up. So we have a primary key that references place and it can be notable. Okay, cool. Why can't you derive show? Why is it notable show? We'll just derive uh, uh, for notable as well, show then. Postgres being core, what did we just say? Maybe in core? And then notable? Never find anything in here. Are you? Did you not show, huh? No, because you're just data. Can't even use this. Maybe I'll make a default place or something. Make a place for everyone. I'll probably do that. Yes. Missing fields. Oh, this is version 9. I can't even do that. <laughs> this is how we do migrations in Haskell. It's gonna be beautiful. Wait. To seriously beam. Someone even asked me about how do I do these things. Well, I do it by copying all of code. There we 
ago. And now you don't know about it, huh? Don't mind my hacks. Don't mind my hacks. Name doesn't match well. The current GC source code seems to dedicate all of its work to the eye anyway. I think there's not much to gain from using IntelliJ plugin there. Who are you talking to? Yeah, like GC, uh, GC this is a small wrapper around uh, GCI to make it like a. Uh, right. I'm sorry to inter interrupt your conversation then. It's very private. Uh, Call name doesn't matter more than name, right? And how did you compile? What does she know about it? I love this song. <laughs> Yeah, so the guy that wrote the plugin, I, I saw a pre presentation of his and he was very, very eager for contributions, even though it was written in Scala. Uh, he gave a presentation on the Haskell meetup in Amsterdam. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, <laughs> I, I felt like they, uh, I would I would try to basically, I would first try to make Haskell work on JVM and, <laughs> and then write a plugin. <laughs> Like a toy project. Actually, two plugins, Scala and one in Kotlin, and they seem to both be well maintained. You know, <laughs> that's amazing. Like they could, they could try to um, abstract their work into modules or something. Because you know, you can use it inter interoperably. Interop you can use the stuff of each other, right? Because of JVM, usually. Usually, you can. Like back when I was using JVM stuff, I could I could freely use Groovy shit together with um, Scala code. <laughs> I, I I committed sacrilege and I was using Groovy code with Scala code. Different parses. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> they reinvented their parses. Wait, why, why aren't you using why aren't you using GT? Oh, right, because they're in Scala land. Right. That's amazing. No. Like. Wrong table. I mean, I copied the wrong thing. This is just doing a bunch of uh, constraints mangling the dot, the dot migration. 